So right here we have the Curly Crow Goes to School hardcover book right here. We actually met the author, Nicholas Aragon, whenever we were traveling through New Mexico. We just met him up at a, a random farmer's market, and uh, we were started talking about what we do, and so he gifted me a few of his books, so I figured I'd make a few videos for you guys. So first of all, I gotta point out that this was the book that started it all. It was actually written by his mom, and I wanna show you guys kind of a compare and contrast between the two, because he really took it to the next level, in my opinion. So first of all, whenever you open this book, this is kind of what the the artwork looked like, and you just had the long text on the side right here, and that's how it's organized all throughout the book. Whenever uh, Nicholas took over, he did a very good job of like really making this pop a little bit more, especially for kids. This is geared towards kids ages four to eight. This particular book is about the stress and anxiety, and uh, the, in particularly going to school. And so he did a really good job of kind of showing like what school's like, what to think about whenever you're going to school and how a lot of kids are, I remember whenever our kids were first going to school, like one kid did really well, they had a great time. The second kid, like they went, they were crying whenever we were dropping them off, all that type of stuff. It was hard. But uh, this book will hopefully make it a little bit easier to be able to make that transition if you are sending your kids to school. So they, you know, they, they, Curly Crow hears the mom talk about school on the phone. She's kind of like, oh, what's that? I'm scared about it. I'm nervous about it. I'm anxious, all that type of stuff. You know, the mom talks about, okay, we just need to pack your things. Here's your things. And uh, we'll get, she says, we'll give it one day. And so she goes to school and they talk about how they like sang songs and drew pictures and had so much fun. One thing I wanted to point out too is that I really like, first of all, Again, the artwork here, it's very vibrant. You can really see what's going on. Uh, it makes a lot of sense to kids. But they did a really good job of utilizing some of the negative space here, the wide open spaces right here, to be able to put the words in there to where it's kind of a part of the picture. And they also did a very good job of contrasting the, the text here. So this is white on this dark green. This is a dark blue on the light blue right there. So it makes it a little bit easier to read as you're going through. So then they talk about, you know, how much fun she had and ready for the next day. They're learning their ABCs and learning how to read. She goes home and she tells her parents all about it every day. Uh, then the next day they're going to learn about numbers and she says that she loves math, but she loves how every day there's recess there. So it kind of really gives you an idea, uh, your kids an idea of what to expect from school, which I think is really cool. And then... Um, at the end, it talks about how every evening after school, whenever the family is around the dinner table, they talk about their day. They talk about their school. And I really love, this. in all of his books, this family aspect that they have. The mom, the dad, and the kids sitting down and like really discussing uh, what's going on in their lives. And so I thought that that was super cool. I love how they incorporate that into all of them. But that's uh, Nicholas right there. There's a little like about the author in the back right here. And uh, he just did a fantastic job with this book. So if your kids are kind of anxious about going to school, kind of stressing about it a little bit, this is a great book just to kind of break the ice about what school is like for your kids. So y'all definitely go and check this out if this is something that you're looking for. Thank y'all for watching and dad out.